What's up? Ugh, what's going on? Dude! People are still prestiging, dude! People are still prestiging, bro! Holy, dude! Congratulations, everyone. Truly. Congratulations. So we live streaming the ball tomorrow or what? Yeah, I gotcha. Here's what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. Probably not streaming, baby. Woo! Dude. Two days on, one day off. You guys know the rules. All right. This is my final stream again. This is it again. Guys, we still have to figure out what exactly the year tagline is going to be because a lot of people are a lot of people think they have good ideas, but they don't. A lot of people think they have good ideas, but they don't. They don't. None of them have been good ideas, guys. And I'll tell you what, you can't say it's the year of it's the year of like the nasty boy because I say that's almost every year. There is I, I see that go by. I see uh, the nasty 2024 like stay nasty. And it's like, that's not it. That's not it. Maybe it's time we need to stop. Guys, maybe it's time we need to stop, like, being bound by this year stuff, because it never mattered. It never mattered. Because, let's be honest, they, meant, uh, they mean about as much as a New Year's resolution does. 2024. I give up. <laughs> it's, it's over. Twenty twenty four is the year I parasocially hang out with my friend Tomato Gaming. True. Dude. Not gonna lie, I was trying to set up a uh, a different stream today, but it just it just wouldn't it just wouldn't it just wouldn't come together, guys. It just wouldn't come together. So I gotta play this instead. I my new I got a new microphone. Not for my real microphone, like to replace this one. This one's never being replaced ever. I'm gonna have the same voice forever. Uh, but I got a better uh, I got a better microphone to use for VR, like a way better one. Like I'm talking like a like 20 times quality upgrade. Oh, but um. Unfortunately, the thing I wanted to stream alongside it was giving me some issues, so... No dice. No dice. 20 times? No way! Dude, I don't know why I didn't think about at any point being like, wait a minute, why don't... Look, the, the wireless infrastructure for my microphone is fine. It's fine. That part can stay the same. The problem is the actual mic. So I just ripped that old piece of shit that came with the wireless setup out and I bought a nice Sennheiser microphone, which is just a string of numbers and letters off of like an actual audio website. Dude, they don't even sell them on Amazon. Amazon literally... Dude, one of the versions of the microphone that you could buy literally didn't have... 
a actual like like plug it comes with two loose wires so i had to be careful not to uh buy that one yeah two loose wires some people want that some people want a freaking wire in the correct line themselves with like solder and shit i don't know like weirdos not me not me not me some people want their mics DIY. Sony and Sennheiser have the best product names. A lot of people will be like, he's sponsored, dude. He's sponsored. He's talking about a brand he likes. But like, I'll tell you what, Sennheiser is one of those like companies for like audio equipment that has not at any point ever failed me in my entire life. Uh, I'm just recommending it as like a, it's very good. They make good stuff. I don't know about Sony. Sony's kind of trashy, guys. I've gotten stuff from Sony and it's been trashy. I've, I got some, th some things I have from Sony are so trashy. I'm still using my blue Yeti from 09. Dude, right on. Right on. So far, Shore has treated me well. Nah, Shore's not that good. I mean, Shore's good. Like, I mean, I used a Shore. But, look, guys. Shore's the streamer. That's the secretly sponsored microphone. <laughs> Every streamer got themselves a Shore SM7B, brother with the little silly wire that sticks out of the microphone and makes it the most susceptible microphone on earth to any problems. It's like, how the hell did that get so popular? It's got a little dinky wire sticking out of it. And if anything happens to that wire, you're fucked. Cheap. It ain't cheap. That mic's like 500 bucks. I mean, maybe it's gone down. When, oh! Oh, no, 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 no! My coffee! This is your fault. My coffee, no! Hang on. Hold up a second, guys. I gotta, I'll be right back. Not on the mic. No, it's on my desk. It's just, it, it landed on my freaking keyboard. And I gotta make sure I don't have a uh, coffee flooding in my keyboard. Everything's fine. Sorry, I was just wiping my keyboard that's still connected to the PC. Whoopsie. Probably unplug this keyboard for a minute and like remove the keys quickly. Everything else is dry. Everything's fine. It's just like a little bit spilled on the keys. I think I might need to. Nah, it's fine. It's fine, but I do think I am gonna unplug the keyboard quickly and like give it a quick clean. Give it, give it a quick rip on out of there. This is your fault. I don't know how to prove it. Yeah, it's a mechanical one. 
I wouldn't care if it wasn't, uh... In, if it wasn't, like, literally a brand new keyboard I just replaced my old one with. So I'm like, man, I don't want it to smell like freaking coffee. <laughs> I'm not even worried about it breaking. These things are, like, fucking invincible. Uh, I just don't want it to smell like coffee. Not that I'm smelling my keyboard. One second. All right, I've got my keyboard disconnected from the stream PC now, so I can really get in there. Should only take me a moment. Come on. Does anyone just have those like key keyboard key removing tools just sitting around? Cause I sure as shit fucking don't dude. Holy crap. I just fucking, I just fucking grab like a knife. I just grab a fucking knife and I just get in there with it, you know what I mean? Oh, it's fine. It's fine in here. I thought it'd be bad, but it's fine. Yeah. Looks like the keys kind of like caught all the coffee and like slurped it all up for me. None of, none of it even reached the hardware. Nice. I could, like, slurp this right back on. <laughs> no. No. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Cool. Give me one, give me one second. One second, then we're good to go. Damn! Yeah! What is wrong with him? What's wrong with me? What's wrong with you? I've seen some of the shit you've typed in my chat. I just haven't brought it up until now. I just haven't brought it up until now. Do not test me. Until I've gotten rid of all the particulates still inside my freaking keyboard. Freaking. How the hell am I gonna remember where all these keys go? I solved it. Guys, the keyboard is saved. The only thing of any consequence that uh, matters that unfortunately ha has, I think, finally reached its time anyways, is um, Guys, it's that, it's that damn, it's that damn, like, I got this, I got this arm, like this, this wrist rest kind of thing for my, for my hand. It's, uh, this thing has, this thing's like a fucking sponge for coffee right now. And I think it's got, I think it's done. I think it's over. It's like, it's like, uh... It was one of my- it, it's over. It's- this thing's over. I'm tossing it in the corner. My wrist is gonna be completely... No, no, it's not for my mouse. I have like a big-ass mouse pad. Uh, like one of those ones that's like made for like god-tier like gamers, except uh, I only use about one uh, sixteenth of it. And I just turn up my sensitivity really high because I'm lazy. But I have one of those ones, those long ones that goes all the way along the keyboard to like... I don't know, my wrists get sore sometimes, man. I don't know, man. Sometimes my wrist gets sore. I need something to like fucking protect my... my hand. And now it's ruined. Oh, I have to plug it. I was like trying to type something on my keyboard and I was confused why it wasn't working. Then I, for, I remembered I unplugged the USB. Boom, dude! Arise! Arise, keyboard, arise! This is actually good timing. I was gonna get on Amazon and I'm just gonna buy a new thing. 
I mean, why, you know, like, why, why not? Just buy a new one, replace it right now. Buy like two of them. Cause the, uh, the next one's gonna get mangled at some point too, uh, absolutely. Yeah. Do your laundry on stream next. Laugh it up. Laugh it up, dude. You guys should be nicer to me. You know, cause you never know when I might snap. And then all of a sudden this coffee ain't gonna be getting poured on no keyboard. It's gonna be getting poured right on my PC tower. All right? As I finally have enough of it and silence these voices for the last time. Can't wait. Yo, Katie, you know that if I, like, go ballistic and, like, quit the platform, you stop getting paid, right? You do know that. Yeah, you stop getting paid if that happens. Yeah. That's all calmed down. No one needs to do anything crazy. Dude, I fucking don't like not having, like, support. My wrists need support, and now I don't have any. My entire gaming skill has been ruined today. Should I switch to gamepad? <laughs> it's over! Guys. It's over! I need a gamepad. I need, like, an Xbox controller. I have to make it a whole day. Day before these things get here to support my wrists again. Oh! Real Yakuza use a gamepad. That's what I'm fucking. But I'm not a Yakuza. All right. God, he's so fragile. Nah, dude. Look, I already learned my lesson because I used to not use those things. I got these huge freaking calluses on my like wrists from from where my wrist would like slide against like the desk with my mouse side. Yeah, I got I got manly hands. All right, I got these. I got gigantic calluses. Yeah. Now I gotta watch out for myself. I gotta take well. I gotta take good care of myself going forward. Can't just make mistakes anymore, guys. Gotta watch out for my body. My hands are actually pretty fucked up from uh, weights, actually, now. I, uh... Be you're supposed to, like, at a certain point when you start lifting enough weight, like, start using some kind of, like, powder and stuff for your hands, right? I didn't do that. I haven't done that. You get, yeah, you get sissy gloves. Yeah, uh... Powder is for grip, not for other stuff. Should I be using, like, lotion? <laughs> Guys! These calluses are pretty bad. It's bad. I feel like I should be using something. Yeah. No, 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 it wouldn't- it wouldn't be a problem if I could ignore them. But, like, once I notice, like, my- like, the, these things on my hands, I'm just like... It's on my mind. It's like the same reason I- I hate, like, growing any kind of facial hair, because the second that, like, 
it gets like long enough and then itchy, it's on my mind. And it doesn't matter if I'm fine. Now it's on my mind and that little itch is enough for me to hate the entire process. All right. Gotta outgrow the itch. I'm not gonna be. I'm fine as is, man. Man, I'm good. Bro. I don't need that. That's only because you have a good jawline. Us soft jaws need a beard. Oh, we, yeah, I mean, I, I wasn't expecting a compliment, but uh, thank you. Dude, that's like, that gives me like whiplash when it's not something I paid for. When it's something I paid for, it's like awesome, cool, rad. When someone does it uh, without me paying. What the? Do not try to invoice me later. Do not even bother. I feel like Tomato Loki built like Kenshi Bugman. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but like one of those ones with a, one, one of those big ones though. What are those huge ones? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> I feel like I shouldn't be like, I feel, I feel like they're, Dude, that, honestly though, thank God I spilled a can of coffee and not a cup of coffee because that cup would have been everywhere. The can, only a bit of it got out because it's a can. Thank fucking God for that. I didn't actually think about that because there's a lot of coffee still in this. Like I, I've still had a, quite a lot to drink. My God. Dude, I hate the fact- like, I've always been like, maybe I just pour these cans into like an actual cup because then I can like, I don't know, put some ice in it. Be a little bit nicer, a little bit easier to drink than using like a can. But like now, man, now that it's happened once, I mean, first of all, I can never drink another drink without like a cap or something on it ever again on stream. This is it, guys. That was the last uh, grip and rip forever. Uh, what if something worse had happened? That's it. I haven't used a mug in years. Mugs are great, dude. No one spills a mug. All right, if you spill a mug, you're just a fucking idiot or like a child. You're an idiot or a child. You don't understand anything about the world. They have heft for a reason. You need a bib, dude. I mean, that's wrong. That's not true. I don't need a bib, but some people probably do. Children can be idiots. I would say all of them are idiots. <laughs> they haven't had time to figure it out yet. Guys, there ain't nothing wrong with that. Real hateful today. Yeah, to my like idiot children demographic that shouldn't be watching because I'd be breaking the rules. So I don't care what I say about them. I don't care. <laughs> what are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? Come get me? You call people who spill idiots. Yeah, because they are. Just like I was. For freaking like waving my hand around this tall can that spilled right under my desk. I felt like a pretty big idiot. But that's never gonna happen again. I 
It's never gonna happen again. Not while I'm here. I remember that one time you banned a viewer because they outed themselves as like under 16. Yeah, and I do that again. If anyone was like, yeah, like unironically, uh, I'm not um, in the age window that you made clear is allowed on your channel. Not age window. I'm not above the specific age. Old people are allowed to watch, okay? To be clear, there's no age window. You don't suddenly get too old and then we ask you to leave. Uh... <laughs> Sorry. You gotta go. You gotta go, you got too old. Just, just cramping the style of everyone else here. Nah, because if I did that eventually, what if I got too old and then people tried to get me to leave because I was, and I quote, cramping the style of everyone else here. Kids next door style. Dude, fuck that shit, dude. Holy crap. If you try to sit me down after I do my time helping some, like, top secret, like, special ops agency and they sit me down a chair and they, and they say sorry idiot we have to melt your brain now and turn you into like a freaking moron dude i'd be a traitor almost immediately guys that'd be it i'd be like yep something's wrong yep something's wrong something's up with that that's fucked up as hell mm -mm. nope no There are traitors, I know, and I don't blame them for it. I know, <laughs> because that's what I would do. And I feel like anyone with a brain would be like, yep, not doing that. I'm not showing up to that today. <laughs> I'm not going to that appointment. What are you kidding me? It's not optional, they find you. Yeah, but it's really like, uh, do, you, do you think it's something they disclose when you're onboarded into that organization? That when you get to like, what, 13, they're gonna melt your brain? You think they disclose that? Did they sign a contract? Because none of those contracts would be legally binding because they're all children. None, nothing they do or say matters. Dude, yeah, right. Yeah, right. Remember the movie, guys? Well, dude, I haven't seen anything from KND in like a hundred million billion trillion years, but I do remember. I do remember that one guy who turned people old. I do remember that one guy, the grandpa, who turned people old. That shit freaked me out when I was a kid. The Wrinkler. Yeah. Yup. Wasn't he just called Grandpa? Yeah, something like that. I don't know, dude. Freaking Kids Next Door's lore was some of the most convoluted bullshit I ever saw in my entire life. There was like deep lore. It was a fun show though. Yeah, it was a good show. Remember that one kid that was cursed into being German? I do. I do remember the one kid who was cursed into being German. <laughs> literally. Literally, his curse was becoming like a, a German child. <laughs> Dude. 
imagine watching that and being uh, like being like a German child, a wee fat German boy, and you're watching Kids Next Door, and they reveal that it's a curse, a horrid curse placed upon this child, and you're just sitting there like, oh. Literally, Curse of Ra. Damn. 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 Look, I look. You guys are like bringing up all these like episodes and stuff. I gotta be honest, guys. I don't remember much of that show. There's not honestly a lot of like the old Cartoon Network shows that people talk about. I don't remember the specifics. I really don't. I remember the broad strokes, but I don't remember like specific details of like any episodes. Like I can remember parts of like Courage the Cowardly Dog more specifically, but that's only because that show actively fucked up parts of my head in like a pretty unacceptable way. That's only because my parents weren't in the room to be like, what the fuck is that? We're changing the channel. Which, I mean, maybe I would have turned out better if they had. There wasn't a single parent in the room when freaking Ramses fucking showed up. Dude, think about that. There ain't a single parent that would have seen that shit and not been like, my kid ain't watching that and like stopped it right there. Rocket1134, thanks for the five gifted subs. Fuck that. Turn that shit off. It gave my brother nightmares as a kid. Dude. Courage was fucked up. Though I'll be honest. The most fucked up episode was the one where it was just a weird guy. The haircut guy who was just weird. You guys remember that? Remember the guy who wasn't Fred, who was just weird? He wasn't even like necessarily evil. He was just like naughty. Dude. Dude. I'll take I'll take like ghosts and ghouls any day over the show confirming to me that it's just a weird like freak. Dude, you know what's another one that still wakes me out to this day? I think it's because of how, like, surreal and fucked up it was, like, when you step back. The, ep the episode with the bananas, guys. You guys remember the banana episode? What was that, that one had, like, really fucked up themes, man. That one was fucking dark. That one was dark. I remember the banana one. Yeah. Remember the one with the dog? Yeah, man. I remember the one with the dog. Yeah, man. I remember the one with the dog in it. Yeah. I had a panic attack at four years old watching an episode because I realized I'm going to die someday. Dude, everyone had one cartoon that was their first introduction to the idea of mortality. And it's such a, I really think that's the part where you uh, become like alive as a child. And you're no longer just like an idiot pile of meat that doesn't know what's going on. Is the moment that your neurons like activate and you're like, oh shit, I'm actually like mortal and I, it's over for me one day. And then you're like, oh, welcome. 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 You know what it's like now. Oh shit, this is actually happening now. I'm not just perpetually moving forward forever. Oh shit. 
tutorial over. I'm trying to remember when it happened for me. I, all I remember is that when I when my brain clicked and I was like, oh, mortality. I think it was, I was on a vacation. I was on a vacation. I was like three or like two. I was two or three. I, probably like closer to like my third birthday. I don't remember why it happened though. I don't remember. I just remember like going downstairs like in the middle of the night and being like, Mom, Dad, it's bad. And then like getting really sad. I don't remember what happened though. It was like three. Yeah. Bad dream? No. No. No, I don't remember. I feel like, here's the thing, I can kind of trust my gut instincts on what may have caused it from stuff that happened around similar times. And dude, I think it might have, I think it might have been, no, could it have? So part of me wants to blame Scooby-Doo Zombie Island. And I don't know why. But I know it was around that time. Part of me wants to blame Scooby-Doo Zombie Island. The one where they- the one where the fucking writers just got fucking absolutely zonked on cocaina and fucking decided everything was real for once. Dude. What were they thinking? I think that- I think that might have been it. I think even as like a three-year-old, I was like... I was obsessed with Scooby-Doo as a kid. Like a little kid. And I think watching that movie... Because my parents naturally would have just been like... I can watch Scooby-Doo. It's Scooby-Doo. None of it's real. It's a movie. It's a movie. We can we can leave him alone and like do whatever else we want. And he'll just sit in front of the TV with his older sister, and they'll just watch Scooby-Doo. And then uh, there was real death in that one. <laughs> there was real death. That's probably what did it. I think that was it. Because I remember I absolutely watched that movie on that vacation. Oh my god. Oh my god. I mean, it's pretty mild. My guy, my brother in Christ for a three-year-old. Yeah, it's pretty mild. <laughs> yeah. Toughen up, kid. Toughen up. Grow up, three-year-old. Stop crying! Stop crying! Man up! Why don't you just man up? But live action, Scooby-Doo. Dude, classic Zoomer thing to say, Jesus Christ. Dude, I was like... That was way after my time, dude, live action Scooby-Doo. I was done with Scooby-Doo by then, dude. I was past it. That was in the rear view. The only thing I remember about live action Scooby-Doo is that Scrappy pissed in everyone's face. Yep. 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 Real. Yep. Real. <laughs> Real, not fake. Scrappy also says fuck. Dude. <sighs> what a mistake that movie was. Did you watch a different version? Did you watch a different version, dude?
Did you watch a different version, dude? Scrappy was literally the main villain. He pissed in everyone's face and then he got mad about it and then he became like an evil creature. That was what happened. They dumped him in the middle of Arizona. Yeah, they really did. Wait, wait, so was the passage of time? So, okay, hang on. So, I'm trying to remember the chronological order of how things played out in the live action movie. Did they? So Scrappy was being annoying to the group and then Scrappy pissed on everyone in the car and they were driving through the middle of Arizona in a desert. So they dumped him in the middle of the desert to die. And then he lived and decided, okay, 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 okay. So this is where I think this, none of this should have happened. But simultaneously, to reveal that the entire group, including Scooby, who who is like, like canonically related to Scrappy, would be okay with abandoning them despite anything in the middle of the desert, is kind of wild. When I step back now, kind of wild. But he pissed in the car. Yeah, but I mean, I, I, even if someone like pissed in my car, I wouldn't be like, now die, now die, now die, foolish child. How dare you pee in my car? If like a child did that, I wouldn't be like, to the Arizona desert with you, child. To the desert with you, exiled. I wouldn't do that to them, I don't think. Banished. Maybe more, maybe, maybe that's my problem. Maybe more people should have the mentality of, oh, did you like mildly, like, did you do something like fucked up or that inconvenienced me in any way? Exiled. Exiled to the Badlands. To the Badlands. To the, to the fucking realm of shadows with you. You're acting like that's the only thing Scrappy did. Okay, what else did they do? All right, since I, I, I've, I've recognized your name now, what else did they do? Give me, give me like bullet points for like um, the, the movie specifically. No, no, Chad, I didn't ask any of you, I asked them. One, he's annoying. All right, that's nothing. You can't exile someone for being annoying. You can't abandon someone in the desert, and when they ask you why, you say, because you're annoying, goodbye. You can't. You can't. Not if you're the main character protagonist of, like, a cartoon franchise. You can't. You have to have better morals than that. I mean, you can because you're a scumbag, but I'm saying that, like, the freaking, like, the gang, the mystery gang can't do that. They're not allowed to. You can. You're a scumbag, and you don't have morals. That's okay. We understand. Dude, I just can't, I just can't move past it, guys. I just can't move past it. Scooby Gang needs to be a beacon of morality. Scooby Gang shouldn't be on the record abandoning puppies in the fucking desert, is what I'm saying. That shouldn't be a thing that I know they did. I don't care who it is. <laughs> Dude. Sometimes justice is harsh. It's 
Scrappy deserved it. Guys, you just feel like Scrappy deserved it because later on they decided vengeance was the only answer and tried to kill the gang. But that, like, honestly, guys, if there was one thing that would make me a supervillain, it would be uh, me being uh, immediately exiled to the desert by someone. That would make me go, yep. Now I have an excuse to be evil. In Arizona. In Arizona, of all places. Jesus, drop me off somewhere nice. Jeez. I'm reading the scrappy wiki now to find his sins. I feel like you're not gonna find that many. Like, here's the thing, like, guys, most people just say scrappy dude is annoying and that's all he did wrong. But like, I, I, I'm standing by a controversial opinion here, guys, and it's that you can't exile someone to the desert for being annoying. It's like the the live action movie writers were just like, this is a funny reason to like get rid of this character. He <laughs> he, this is gonna set up our like our like antagonist. But they didn't think for a second. Hey, does this make the mystery gang look like fucking monsters? <laughs> hey guys, should we step back and acknowledge whether or not this brings in to question the moral compass of <laughs> our protagonists? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. They're the heroes. Check the villains wiki tomato. Oh my God. God. Scrappy. Oh, hang on. Oh, shit. Hold up. I gotta turn off. Uh... Hang on. Grab my other keyboard. I have to turn off Synergy and restart it. Give me a second. My keyboard is fucking up on my other uh, computer. There we go. Scrappy. It, wait, is it just... Hang on. Is it working now? There may be lingering issues from my... Uh, from the coffee event, guys. Hang on. Hello? Is there... Oh, caps lock was on. Was that it? Alt tab works. My windows key does it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I mean, I have the other keyboard. I have a backup. I literally have backup keyboards. But, uh, that's inconvenient for me. Now, let me try turning off the, uh, game quick. Yeah, no. What the fuck is this thing doing? Ah, someone pull it up for me. Pull up Scrappy-Doo for me. Come on. Pull it up. Uh, yeah, I might have to, uh... Yeah, I might have to fix that. Damn, man! Oh well, hang on. Oh yeah, this keyboard's fucked. <laughs> oh yeah! Uh, it looks fine. It was working fine up until a minute ago, but now it seems to be having a problem. Try to plug it, plug it back in. It's fine, guys. I have a replacement. I literally buy like two of these at a time, uh, just in case there's a problem. 
Because, uh, you know, my job. <laughs> my job. I uh, don't leave. I don't go anywhere without uh, backups. Okay. Uh, yeah, let me let me actually like fix that then. It's gonna take me one second. I gotta mute while I grab this. second and unplug this one plug it in with this one boom does it work all right one more sec This is when he finds out it's a software issue. Uh, well, no, friend, because I spilled a whole can of coffee on my keyboard, so I do know the issue. <laughs> I, I do, in fact, know the, the uh, source of my sudden problem that wasn't here before today. Uh, it's pretty easy. <laughs> There we go. I just had to uh, coil it around in a weird way, the cords, because um, my keyboard has some USB ports, which I use for my mouse on the game PC. So I just had to replug them on this one. There we go. Mouse is fixed. Start button's working. We're good. Perfect. Back in business. What did Scrappy do? Do. Scrappy do. Weird how the third uh, third result is found dead in Miami. We don't care about that. Uh, villains wiki. Explain. Oh, actually, uh, right before I do that, let me buy another one of these keyboards. Dude, I don't let my backups ever. I don't let my backups ever run out. So. uh... Hang on. Yep. Buy it again. Buy it again. Warranty protection. What am I, some kind of idiot who pours coffee on his keyboards? Check out. Order it now. Fuck you. Boom, boom, bam. Okay, here we go. So let's see here. Goal, all right, all right, all right. Here's the crimes I have. I have Scrappy do on the villains uh, wiki with their crimes and their type of villain. Now, first of all, Scrappy do is known as a vengeful fallen hero. Uh, I would say that's probably a fair way to put it considering he was exiled, actually exiled to um, to the desert. Uh, let's see here. <clears throat> Crimes. Mass enslavement. Bad look. But this was all... Guys, this doesn't excuse his actions, but you have to remember that his the cause of these actions was exile. He wasn't... Attempted world domination, I would disagree. He dominated a small island at best. Treason. To who? Treason to the mystery gang? What do you mean treason? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Treason against who? Treason against the state? What was he trying? Treason. <laughs> they, what do you mean? Treason against Fred? Fred? 
Kidnapping? Okay. Human sacrifice? I think that did happen, or he tried. That might have been attempted human sacrifice. <clears throat> attempted? A Von Colossi. Dude, they're reaching. They're reaching. What does that fucking mean? What attempted avancolicide? They're reaching. People are trying to take down Scrappy by whatever means possible. Avancolicide is the act of killing an uncle. Ah. Ah. But Scooby has attempted like murder of like scrappy by abandoning him in the fucking desert to die i would say i would say doing that without leaving scrappy with any kind of means to survive is attempted murder in the same way i look scrappy chose to leave did he did he he chose to bail During a flashback recalled by Velma at one point in the film. Ah, yes. <laughs> Hold up, guys. Now, someone's got to back up Scrappy here as we move forward because no one else will. Biased POV. <laughs> Biased as all hell POV, dude. Biased. Hmm. That is a flashback that is not from a reliable narrator. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Scrappy is first seen harassing the gang in the mystery machine, bragging about how he will fight ghosts and monsters. Fred annoyingly tells him he has told him before ghosts do not exist. Referencing the fact that versions of the show Scrappy are in our... Uh, by portraying real supernatural creatures as commonplace. Scrappy argues that ghosts do exist, and when he finds him, he'll give them a dose of his puppy power, and then he accidentally urinates on Daphne. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that escalated really fast. Accidentally. Accidentally. Even in the flashback, Accidentally, Velma acknowledges it as an accident. Much to Daphne's disgust. Acceptable, we can understand that. When Scrappy realizes this, he gasps in shock. Ah, shock, because he didn't mean to do it. And Fred immediately stops the mystery machine, sending Scrappy flying into the windscreen. Okay. All right. All right, I'm still going through it, guys. As he slides off, Fred angrily scolds him for urinating on Daphne. After fixing himself, Scrappy crosses his arms and irritably states it was an accident. But Fred calls his bluff and furiously accuses him of marking his territory. What the fuck? I don't know. Fred's kind of weird, guys. <laughs> guys? <laughs> guys, I, I, think, I think Fred's kind of weird. Fred, this sucks, Fred. Fred. <laughs> Fred, what the fuck? <laughs> wait, 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 what the fuck did you say? Okay. Scrappy angrily tells him he isn't worthy of being the team leader. Okay. He then demands the gang appoints him as the new leader or else he'll leave. Scrappy is then thrown out of the van in the middle of the desert along with his suitcase with no one giving a second thought, not even Scooby. Okay, they, uh, he attempted a coup on Fred, and Fred, uh... Dude, first of all, again, though, kind of questionable that Scooby didn't say anything. Like, even like, hey guys, that's like still... That... That's my nephew. I have to, like, watch out. I, I can't, uh, we can't just leave them out here. But uh, we'll move past that for now. We'll move past that for now. Uh, let's see here. Um, the puppy hollers out to them that they can't do this since people adore him, which is not exactly true. Uh, I would argue that's that is the case. I think we can agree on that. He then angrily kicks his suitcase in frustration and anger, then painfully hurts his foot. Crappy says... 
he's uh, as cute as a Powerpuff Girl and that he'll get his own TV show as he sits on his suitcase alone and friendless. Wow, the writer of this is like really le leaning into like uh, how um, how alone and miserable Scrappy is. <laughs> I don't think Scrappy at any point says he's alone and friendless. The writer here of the uh, this is like, geez. Scrappy, however, after this, Scrappy plotted revenge against his former friends, despite that it was his own fault for being a bad friend and a jerk to all of them. Okay, that, guys, I'm starting to worry that also the writer for this villain wiki is a little bit uh, biased as well. A little biased on this one too. That's extra that that makes me question it a little bit. Keep reading. I don't need to, guys. Let's go straight to the crimes. Uh attempted mass murder, crimes against humanity, extortion, blackmail, brainwashing, usage of dark magic. Since when is that illegal? Since when is simply the usage of it illegal? I, I, I'm sorry, last I checked, there's no laws for that. Where, which, in which fucking country are you gonna be tried for black magic other than, I don't know, like Salem in the 1600s? Okay, give me a fucking break. Give me a break. Give me a break. Give me a break. Uh, forced confinement. God, this is a long one. Theft, abuse, abuse of power, torture, destruction, usurpation, conspiracy, mass grand theft, animarum, animarum, identity theft, public urination, Indecent exposure. Well, if it's indecent exposure, I'm afraid Scooby's also, uh, that's got to be on his freaking sheet, too. All right, he's a dog. <laughs> Dude, what do you mean indecent exposure? He's a dog. It's a dog. I think all animals should wear clothes. I think, I think all dogs should have to wear clothes. And battery. Hang on. Yeah, I mean, there is, the goals here really don't, but like, you gotta work, look guys, I would argue Scrappy of all the villains that I've seen in this was in desperate need of a therapist, more so than anything. And like, I don't know, a friend. Cause um, his goals were join the gang and become their leader formally. And then it became get revenge on his former friends, uh, Mystery Inc and kill them for abandoning him. Okay. And then his, his most recent goal was sacrifice his uncle Scooby-Doo and steal a pure soul from him in order to complete his transformation as Scrappy Rex and become unstoppable, enslave Spooky Island, and the world with an army of demons. Okay. Textbook abandonment issues, guys. Textbook abandonment issues. He needs a, He needs to see a therapist. Gold dude. <laughs> I get it. Some other people might not get it. I get it. Jesus. Damn, guys. I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna go out and say it, guys. I think. I think Scrappy's existence is, uh, I mean, I think a lot of, a lot of the issue here is also on the gang for treating him, for exiling him. I don't think exile was the answer. You push anyone far enough, they're gonna wanna commit mass omnicide. Do you understand? You push anyone far enough.
Yep. All right, guys, I'm gonna go bath and then we're gonna get in game. Then we're gonna get in game. We got a huge stream today. And by a huge stream today, I mean a normal stream today. But I'm gonna get in game after I go to the bathroom. All right, be right back. I don't know why I stopped the music. I meant to mute my microphone. All right, it's time. <clears throat> Man, chat, all I'm saying is that with the amount of piss I see in chat, looks like a lot of you would be exiled to the desert too, I mean. Maybe you ought to put yourself in Scrappy's shoes for a second. You disgusting fucking animals. All right. All right. Wrong world. Wrong, wrong world. Why that big old pile of fuzz sleeping like that? Play. Throw that save in the trash. You don't need it anymore. Now, here's what I'm thinking. Hard mode. Permadeath and XP enabled. Faster hunger loss. More frequent events. Tougher beasts. Health regeneration disabled. I am not a pussy. Alright, we're playing this on the hardest difficulty. Permadeath. Alright. Let's fucking roll. The story so far. Okay, guys, so if you follow the story here, it looks like we fell out of a spaceship that exploded with a frowny face, and then we fell, and we went, ah! and then we landed right here. On Earth. Wow. Here we are. WASD to move. Left mouse to click uh, to attack. Right mouse to interact. Whoa. Whoa. This world's fucked. We're gonna die out here, probably. First thing we should do is take a look around, try to find some supplies. It's day one, 10 a.m. I see a building over there. We should go that way. Come on. What's that sound? Oh, what the fuck is that? Hey! Hello? Oh! Hey! Oh. Get the fuck over here. Boom! Hit it with the- Get it with the freaking spinning uppercut! Oh! Get the fuck out of here! Guys, we need food. My guy's already really hungry. 
Come here, you. Get the hell over here. Boom! Murdered a poor, defenseless pig beast, you monster. Whatever, they tried to kill me first. You saw them approach me. All right, we got ourselves some meat and some leather. Nice, we still need to find wood. There seems to be a head here. Oh, there's a crafting menu. I can make bait. Okay, we can make all the basics. Cooked meat if I had a campfire, which I don't have a campfire. I need five wood and five stone for that. I have no idea how to get stone or wood. Oh, hang on. Smash rock. I think I need a pickaxe for that. Uh, hang on. Let me just... Nope, we're good. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and turn this into um a rock, a bunch of stones. Boom, dude. All right, we got all the basics. We got some copper. What the fuck? Oh, the sun's setting. Sun setting on the first day, and what the hell? Oh, guys. We better get a move on. Hello. Hello. Uh, what do you want? I don't have anything for you. I'm gone. Let's just get wood and move on. Come on, I see, I see a tree here. We can collect this for sure. Just remember, we're playing on hardcore permadeath. If something hits us, that could be it. Let's just grab all this wood and make some tools. Starting with a wooden axe. Wait. Never mind, I only have four wood. I'm gonna need more of that. This is gonna work really well, guys. Almost at 50% hunger already. Grab it. Grab it. We're gonna need to remember to replant these acorns. X. Boom, X made. Get it on my freaking hot bar. Let's roll. All right, we got a weapon to defend ourselves. Check out how much faster we cut this tree now. Boom. Tap to cycle tools and weapons and R to cycle other equipment. Copy that. Is that food? We're gonna need that. That's a seed. Not to be confused with acorns. Just grab as much of this wood as we can. Thankfully, nothing's dared attack us out here and it's midnight, the witching hour. I mean, is it? What is the witching hour? Is it the witching hour three? Guys, 3 a.m.? Then what's midnight? Why is it midnight spooky, too? Is midnight just normally, like, a little bit less spooky, but still spooky? Anyways, right now, it's just about 3 a.m., which is the witching hour, which is why there's a spooky fog thro blowing through the swampland that I've chosen to call my home. It's 3 a.m., we better be careful. Now is when things could be there. I got a flapple. It's a flapple. Eat that. All right, I ate it. That filled up my hunger back to, f uh, well, a little bit above half. I didn't actually see how much it moved it, but it felt like a lot. What the fuck is that? Oh, what the fuck is that? Where are you? Oh, it got closer when I wasn't looking. I'm out of here. Oh. Oh, is it making those sounds? I'm out of here. I'm going to make a pickaxe. Thank God we made it through the day. I'm going to make a shovel too. Pickaxe, boom. Shovel. Boom. And now, it's time to start... Figuring out how I'm gonna survive. We need a campfire. We need five wood and five stone. Come on. This is how Scrappy survived in the desert. True. Guys, do you fucking see that on the hill? Right there. Is that a nether portal? Oh my god. We better get a move on. Hang on. I need to grab more wood and stone. We're gonna need quite a bit to survive this crazy place. 
What do I do with acorns? Use a shovel to impregnate the ground. Don't like how they put it, but that's fine. Don't like how they put it. Did I make a shovel? Because I should be, I, there's not that many trees out here. I should be replanting these trees. Hang on, shovel. Boom. Oh, what the fuck is that? Cave ahead. I dug up a cave? Okay. Potential danger slash goodies inside. While inside saving is disabled and quitting will have severe consequences. It's worth the risk. Get in there. I mean... Come on. Let's find something worth our time. And also get some rocks. Just keep your eyes peeled for any creatures might try to sneak up on us and remember how we got in. Takes my character a while to pick up stuff off the ground. Break this too. Elite mobs? It's not gonna be elite mobs and we're gonna run from them anyways. We're probably faster than them. I'm not worried. Either way, I need the rocks. So this is actually really good for us guys. What the fuck was that time? Hello? Let's get the hell out of here. It's really fucking dark in here guys. But we're getting loads of ores. Oh! Oh! You fucking really think you're- ah! ah! Die, you freak! Die! Ah! Oh! Give me that. Pick that up. I ain't about to get owned by some freaking creature. Grab all this crap. Why does my character go so slow when he's picking stuff up? We're gonna need all this ore. I heard another one of those fucking things. Hang on, do I have food anywhere? I could make a fire down here. Cook up this meat I have. Look, we've got enough rocks, but I wanna, I wanna, oh shit, there's another one of those things. I just wanted to take a peek around to see if maybe there was other loot down here that wasn't like, you know, copper ore. Before I get the hell out of here. But it's looking like a no. What is that? Hang on, that looks like gold. What is it? More copper. We're gonna grab this. We're gonna grab this. I mean, I know I'm gonna need a bunch of this stuff, probably. Oh, I'm eating this mushroom freaking raw, guys, right now. Eat it if you want, but it might be poisonous cooking it at first. It's probably wiser. Never tell me the odds. It's gonna be fine. 15%, not even poisonous. We're good. I'm gonna chop these. Get some more wood. Nothing even happened. Wait! Nice. Guys, I get the weird feeling there's some kind of treasure in this place. We just have to look harder. Or, there's not. And we're done here. I think I'm getting out of this cave. Yeah, I think we're done here, guys. I'm gonna leave. Yup, let's get the hell out of here. I'm finished with this cave. Goodbye. Now, I'm gonna dig back up right here and plant all these freaking acorns. Just so they exist somewhere. Bury something. Nope, keep digging. Dig, dig, dig. Boom, boom. Acorn. Ignore that sound. Doesn't concern me right now. Acorn. Seed. Why would I bury leather? Wait. Why? Why would I bury? I, I, we're gonna move past that. Stone. Stone. This is, you know what? This is actually a really nice place to live. 
Aside from that creature up there. I think we make this place our home. We're gonna make a fire, campfire, right here. And we're gonna place it, boom, right there. And it doesn't burn me to go near it, that's good. Now then. I would like to cook... Meat. I don't think it works like that. Pick up the meat again. Now then. I would like to craft... Cooked meat. I'm hungry. Good. And again. This will sustain us for quite some time in these wastelands. Eat the meat. Oh, yes. Now, come on. I have some exploring to do. There's been this strange creature over here. Hey. What's wrong? The fuck is that thing? How the hell do I... Oh! I don't know what to do for this. It's trapped inside this thing. Oh, there's a... There's some kind of lever up there. You guys think I can jump up from here? Ain't no way. Am I being shot at? I think I'm being shot at. Oh! Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Insert uranium. Guys, I don't have uranium. Well, we need food and water to survive. Let's get a move on. We got a lot of work to do. We need to build ourselves a base still. I think we'll live by where I already put down my stuff. Oh, nice. We can get rocks and stuff from just digging. Is that just faster than me breaking stuff? I think so. Oh, wait. My shovel just broke. Never mind. Never mind. It is not faster. Matter of fact, it's way worse. I need another one of these. Alright, guys. I'm gonna head back to my home base. I'm gonna eat these mushrooms on the way. I'm gonna grab them. How do I cook them? Mushroom at a campfire makes mushroom soup if I get three of them. That's pretty good. That might just get us out of here alive. Is that a telephone box? Don't get distracted. It's probably a barrage. Oh, there's a pig. I should kill that thing and eat it. As soon as I grab whatever's inside this barrel. Sorry to do this to you. Where are you running to? Sunsets. My weapons are not ideal. Matter of fact, I don't have a real weapon. But we got them. Press jump while attacking to do a combat roll and dodge enemy attacks. Oh. Okay. Well, I got like a little roll I can do. Nice. Where the hell did I... Is that a soccer ball? Hang on. Hang on, guys. I see something. Guys, I gotta get the fuck out of here. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Help! Help me! Fuck off! What do you want? He fears the head. He fears the head. This will be where we make a home. What the fuck was it? Oh shit, that one doesn't fear the That one does not fear the head. Hang on. We gotta fight for our lives for one more night, guys. And then we'll make a house, a home for ourselves. As soon as I stun lock this freaking creature. Oh! 
fucking die. Just die already. Alright, my inventory's full. I can't pick up that slime. Okay. Make a campfire so I can see. And cook. Right next to the head. Cook up some meat. This will keep me alive. Or just a bit longer. Eat that. And there's no way this mushroom kills me. Oh, it was delicious. Smile. Okay, good. It was, guys, it wasn't bad for me. Everything's okay. It was actually really good. I'm gonna plant this one seed and this seed will save our people in time. Now, I need a lot of wood in order to make a workbench so that we can kind of progress beyond our current capabilities. So bear with me here. We're gonna need to get some serious collecting in. When's the sun gonna freaking rise? I think these slime things only come out at night. Oh, d a delicious snack! Guys. Why does it look like a bird? Flapple. Wait. Some kind of alien fruit with wings for some reason. Eat it. We're barely hanging on. Currently our objective is to find uranium so that we can free that creature over there. It's the only chance we have of making it out of this place. Freaking logs are almost impossible to collect. I have 12 logs right now. We have to make a workbench. Nothing else matters. What the hell is that thing over there? You see that? Some kind of weird looking snake thing. But it's got legs. Oh, what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? That's it. I don't know what you oh, think you could think you're doing in there, but, oh, but you're dead now. Some kind of wood creature. Just don't have time for it. How much wood do I have? 17. A little bit more and we're done here. Did that apple have legs? Well, yeah, because it's a flapple. It's not an apple. It's a flapple. If it was an apple, it would look like an apple. I'm gonna grab all this stuff and then we're gonna find a way off this rock. The Lorax? It was kinda... Yeah, that... Oh! The, the, one second. Ow! Okay. See, I don't think I'm using a real weapon, which is why my character's got one move. Which is to just hit them with a two- Oh, shit. Not gonna let you fucking get me like that again. I'm gonna start doing moves now. That's it. I'm about to pop off. Boom. Get the fuck out of here. Give me these. Grab all these rocks. Look at the head. Guys, look at the- There's another one. Hang on. Boom. Boom. Animation cancel. Boom. Animation cancel. Boom. Jump over him. Smack him again. Dodge. Boom. Dodge. Boom. Sun setting. Dumb burger fucking thing. Don't be mean to them. What's that sound? Day four in this place. My health ain't getting any better. I'm actually feeling medically quite bad. Not sure how to survive in this place for much longer. Don't know what I'm doing wrong. I'm getting real hungry. Feel like I need to make something. Wait a minute. A wooden staff. Well, I'd rather make the workbench, though. Because that'll make me make even more stuff. 
guided by the light of the eyes of this freaking Easter Island head. We still have a chance of getting out of this, guys. I just have to make a workbench. New crafting recipes enabled. Such as... Hang on, I also want to make a smelter. Right now. Power tools? Well, yeah, I mean, I don't leave the house without my power tools, guys. Yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna leave the house without the tools. Fire up the smelter! Now, I'm gonna go ahead and make a boatload of copper bars. Well, just kind of fall on the ground because I have no one. I have no space in my inventory for it. It's raining. Real shitty night for it. Just make some more copper. We need to arm ourselves. Okay. Grab all this. Can I make a real weapon? No, but I could make a wooden mask for armor. I also know how to make stone tools now, and inventory upgrades if only I had one mysterious goop. Just focus. It doesn't even know we're here. Let's just focus. Oh, I can... I need some wood? Aw, oh, fuck. Hang on, guys. Oh. Found some ore and a old boot. Wait, didn't I need that? Wait, I found another old boot. Hang on a second here, this could be really good for us. If I get two old boots and one copper bar, I can make jumping shoes. Hold up, chat. Stuff's starting to look better. We're making jumping shoes. Fog's coming in. Uh, yeah. How do I equip these? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. I'd like to see anyone get me now when I'm walking around in these fucking things. Holy shit, I got moon shoes. Okay. I mean, I'm gonna need a lot of wood things that we're gonna have to oh my god yeah good fucking luck getting me now I don't know how to heal guys that's a, a, a situation also I need more rocks and I'm afraid to like go to some parts of the map like I'm afraid to leave this place because I know the things happening here I feel like I just need to let my shit, like, my, my plants grow and, like, kind of get better tools. My axe just broke. I'm fucked. But good news is I know how to make stone tools now, so I guess I'll just make stone versions of these things and I'll also do more damage. At some point, I have to venture beyond this realm, but I think I see a fucking xenomorph over there and I think it sees me. I don't know it doesn't, but it definitely lunged. Why my Furby wearing Tims? These aren't Tims, these are freaking moon shoes. I have some respect. Guys, that's not a friend. I'm telling you right now, that thing is not a friend. My freaking inventory, dude. How do I expand it? Old boot. We can dismantle old boots. Or we can make old boots with leather. Okay. Also make iron bars. I need mysterious- Where the hell am I gonna find goop? Damn it! I don't know where I find mysterious goop. I need to make a- I need to make a fucking wonderful garden, guys. Right now. Plant. Plant. Stuff's growing. I see it getting larger. Boom. 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 Sometimes I dig up slime. 
Not sure how that keeps happening. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, I'm getting a lot of stuff out of digging. Also, what happens if I bury leather? Why did that make a tree? Wait, why are these ma- it doesn't matter. What the fuck is going on today? It looks really scary out. We need food. Guys, we need to focus. I'm making a stone axe, a stone pickaxe, and a stone- well- OH! OH! What the hell was that? My god, it came right out of the ground at me! Faster! Make yourself more stuff faster! What am I out of? I need more wood. Easter Island head. Everything that I offer you in this bucket is actually stuff I want back. One shoe. Uh. One slime. Some plants. Here you go. Yes. Very good. I need to go hunt for food, guys. Uh, wait, I have a flapple and some mushrooms, but I, I kind of want better food, guys. And I need wood. Oh, my trees are coming in from over here. Good. Did I see that soccer ball? Did you guys see that? Hell yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. We got work to do. We live off of flapples. You understand? This is how we survive. We eat nothing but flapples. We got a flapple-based diet. Did my health just go down? It's at 43. Am I losing health for some reason? Do I have, like, bad medical issues? No, oh, don't tell me that. Flapples are poison. No, they're fucking not. Jesus! And a lot of stuff out of this. Not bad. Not bad at all. Eat some more flapples. It's good for you. And eat. And go ahead and make a stone pickaxe when we get back to a workbench. This needs to be upgraded. Guys, I don't know what the hell that freaking phone booth is doing over there, but if there's a way that I can call my parents to pick me up today, I'm going to do it. So I'm going to go do that right now, and we're going to see. Mom? Mama? You need some wiring to fix this. It's broken. Oh my god. Another day comes and goes. What's this? A beautiful sandcastle? Oh, get rid of that. Give me this. I don't know why I'd need sand, but give it to me. Perfect. That was someone's home? I don't care. I do not care. Upgrade a campfire to cook up some tasty nom noms. Jesus, what the fuck? There's a lot of stuff. Uh, I am still bare. I'm still barely able to feed myself, guys. I need to focus on the important things. I'm evolving, though. Slowly, I'm becoming smarter. I'm growing into something different. Something faster, better, stronger, that jumps higher. Broke and dying POV. Wrong. My health is at 43% still. I just checked. This place is... Look, I've got a beautiful clearing for making a home right here, dude. My trees are coming in. Plants are growing. I'm about to make a freaking pickaxe. A new one to replace this old one, which is going to break in a second when I hit that rock over there. Remember, we're playing on permadeath, guys. If I die, we have to restart from scratch. 
We do not want to die. What's that sound? Okay, we need to make a house. I think a house would be good. But so would food. I'm out of flapples. Guys, I'm out of flapples. Wait, what is this? Mysterious goop! Beep, 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 beep! We have goop. I didn't even realize we had goop. Hang on, we need to grab this other goop. Turns out this was the goop we needed all along. Are we supposed to sleep? I don't know. I don't have eyelids. Five leather and a workbench. I don't have five leather. I can make soup, though. We are not going to starve today, though, chat. That I can tell you. Everyone, come on over here. I'm making us a delicious mushroom soup. 50 hunger, and it raised my health. Yeah, mushroom soup is how we make it out of here alive, guys. I need a weapon. Like a real one. I build an anvil. No pray tell, would that be two iron bars? I can do that. Matter of fact, I could probably make that really fast right now. Iron ore. One. Can I make another? I don't have enough. Dude, how do I make a chest? 20 wood and a copper bar. It would be worth it if I had the wood. I feel like wood's going to be a forever problem. Until those trees I planted grow in. Mushroom soup is pretty good. Yeah, I bet. Oh, no. Get the fuck away from me. Guys, I have to make that staff. I think I need a real weapon. The problem is I'm fighting... I'm fighting these creatures. I mean, I can outrun them like crazy fast with the jumping move. But I'm fighting creatures and I don't have a real weapon. All I have is like spam left click. With tools. It's gonna cost me. Soon. I can tell. Another flapple, thank god. Grab all this crap. Eat the flapple. Eat the flapple. What does this plant do? I don't know. So it seems like every big rock makes a mushroom, which is pretty good for me. Once I build a house, though, it's time to explore. It's time to get the hell out of this place. I don't want to be at this place forever. Cooking pot, no. Well, how much wood am I still short? Quite a bit. But I've used all the wood on this island. I'd have to go across to where the xenomorph is to get more, or into the glowing biome over here. Where things look extra shitty. And slime creatures jump out of the ground. It's fine. We're taking all these acorns with me and I'm gonna plant them by my house so they will never have to go anywhere else. I don't know why I decided to live next to the evil goo biome, but it sucks. Grab all this. Oh! Oh, he spat something at me from halfway across the goddamn map. I thought he only had melee attacks. Oh, that was half my health. Oh, shit. <laughs> They're camping me. There's... Oh. Mother of God. Oh. I banish you back to hell. Back to hell with you, son. Arise. Arise, son, and burn away the slime monsters. Arise! 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 You're gonna die in a second when the sun comes up. There it is. Die. He's gone. They're all gone. Thank God. Come on. Aw. I put the flower in the boot by accident. That's kind of cute. I like that. I have enough to make the chest. I darn. That's a really small chest. I sure hope this like is good. That's not bad actually. Now I can put some of my crap away. I've got a lot of ores and the ores don't really have much value until you actually use them like 
Like, they take up a lot of inventory space, and they're kind of expensive to use, like, right away. So we're just gonna start putting stuff in the chest. Okay, I need to shovel more. What is this? What am I making? Don't matter. Keep using acorns. My shovel broke. That's fine. Was that a normal wood shovel? It was. Okay, acorns. Boom. 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 Bam. Boom. Ignore that, it doesn't mean anything. Oh shit. Oh fuck. What the fuck? Hey! Hey! What the fuck do you think you're doing? Put that down! Put that down! Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here. Get lost. You can't take that. That's my workbench. That's it. That's it. That's it. I'm killing him. That's it. This guy dies. If he doesn't get the fuck out of here, he dies. Hey, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. That's it. Airstrike move. He's just as fast as me in a straightaway. There's nothing I can do to stop him from doing this. Pick this up. You gotta be kidding me. Dude, get away from it! Fucking kill you. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> You're dead. That's the water, motherfucker. You're not going anywhere. Come back! Alright, I'm cool. I fucking hate him. What is this? I'm cool. Oh, look at all this. Look at all this crafting materials. Dude, I'm fucking getting real hungry dealing with this guy. This is pissing me the fuck off. Oh my god. I literally don't have time for this. Get the hell out of here. I need wood to light a fire. He's gonna steal my fucking shit when I go and get wood. I'm gonna starve to death off of this guy. Fuck off. Go away. Oh no. He put, he popped. He actually just popped. It's fine, let me just grab some wood. Maybe he just, was that me? No, I make that sound when I jump too. Okay. Guys, I don't know how I'm gonna make it out of this one. I don't. I'm real hungry and I haven't seen a pig to eat in a long. Ah! Fucking asshole. It's tree guy again. He has a range attack. Stun lock him. Gotcha. Give me all this. A flapple. That'll keep me barely alive. Thank God. I'm on life support, but I might make it out of this still. There's a chance. Where's your ranged attack, Bozo? Dude, until trees grow, I don't have anything. Like, genuinely. I don't even know. Like, I planted, like agricultural products like I've got produce growing I don't even know what it makes I plant all these seeds I don't know how to actually do anything with them like I'm fucked guys it's over that one flapple was all I had to my name and there's slime creatures everywhere it's only 1 a.m. and for some reason I have leather growing and I don't even know what that means it's a small tree I couldn't tell you why I have leather growing. This trusty stick of doom hits multiple targets. I don't know if that's better than what I have. What's my axe? Hang on, let me check my stone axe. Stone axe says it does 10 damage. Wait, what if I- I don't have bait! Wait. It doesn't say it won't work though. I'm making a fishing rod. We have to take advantage of the land. 
We have to take advantage of the land around us and the water around us. That's why I'm getting into fishing. Come on, chat. We got a beautiful pond right here. Sun's about to rise and I'll tell- Oh my god, I almost got freaking murked. Okay, it's whatever. I'm gonna do some fishing. How the f- what? After dangling your rod into the water for a while, a little fishy will appear. The little fishy will dance around the red dot, which will slowly get larger over time. When the fishy touches the red dot, it'll turn green. That means it's time to click the left mouse button. Time it correctly, it'll snag the fish. Time incorrectly, it'll take too long and the fishy will swim away. Okay. How long could this take? Come on. Psst, 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 psst. Oh, we got something. Gotta wait till it touches. Gotcha, motherfucker. A dollar? No, I need... No. I need food. I have 26% hunger. I can't survive another night. Dude, it's bad. My guy's complaining about it. I need food. I... I Come on now. Gotcha. It's gonna keep me alive. Fish again. Are you this desperate? Yes, I am. Dude, I am. We got something on the line. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, what is that legal? Is it allowed to never go near it? It's not allowed to do that. What do you mean? Dude, I'm gonna die. This is it. The end of my life. It's 1 p.m. I've caught one blobfish today. Not much else has shown itself. I'm gonna recast. Guys, I may have to venture- Oh no. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, my tummy. Guys, I'm starving to death. Bad. Guys, it's bad. My tummy, dude. Maybe you can eat the reeds. IRL, they have edible roots. Yeah, you're right. This game is very connected to IRL in a major way. Y'all remember how I made my spring shoes out of mysterious goop? Something needs to bite. That's it. You want to do something right, you got to do it yourself. I need to go hunt down a pig, even if it takes me forever. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Another portal. Why is my hunger going down so hard? What have I done wrong? I can't eat that. Piggy, dies. Oh! Why did I choose to live next to a? Fucking wasteland! I'm gonna have to eat it raw. It's fine, it didn't kill me. We're gonna live. I was just trying to save that mushroom. I really was. The fuck is that thing? That's a giant yeti. I'm not gonna fuck with that. I hear something. Pig! 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 Die! You're my food now! Well, I'm gonna eat you! The hell you going? 
Grab this mushroom. Wait, what the fuck is that? Someone lives in a Who the hell is that? This is my house now. What's up? Where are you? <laughs> okay, goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs> goodbye. And I'll see you later. I don't know what just happened, but I lived. Pigs. More pigs. You guys see that animation cancel I did? Yeah. We're gonna live for a thousand years after all these hogs! Spin roll! Spin roll! Rapid fire attack! Animation cancel! Roll! Spin! Grab all this. We gotta get home. I need to get home now to cook this. Gotta get back to the head! Do I have wood? I do. Come on! We need to get back to the head! No! Oh, I ran day and night. I, ju I just kept running day and night back to my back to my safe house. Light the campfire. Cook up a bunch of cooked meat. I lived. Wait, maybe I should make, before I cook the rest of these, maybe I make a cooking pot and see what I can make out of that before I do something stupid. Five wood, one copper bar, and one campfire. I can do that. I can go get that. Because maybe I can make something that's better with the amount of stuff I have. Now some of this wood is coming in too. We can actually like... We actually have like... You know. We got options. Oh! Mother of God! Who's playing the drums? My wood! What's happening? What the... They're, they're fucking channeling something! Stop that! Stop! Oh! 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 It's mine! The water's mine! I need it! Oh! Stay away from it! The festival is canceled. All this bounty is mine at long last. Damn, this is pathetic. The freaking like the tiki warriors rose up to channel me out with prayers and magic. And they failed. Okay, I used an axe and I killed them all. They failed. They blew it. And now, it's time for me to make a freaking campfire cooking pot. They tried to curse me. Bad ending for them. New crafting recipes unlocked. Let's see what I can make. Not one of these was worth my time. I'm cooking meat. Before it's too late. Cook all of it. What if I save one and I turn it into bait? Guys. I'm gonna turn one of these meats into bait. Oh, that makes ten per! We're turning the rest into bait and we're gonna catch blobfish tonight. And we're gonna turn that into delicious fish fillets this is how we survive how do i use the bait on this 
Okay, it looks like it just uses it automatically. Let's get fishing. Come on. That was way faster. Holy shit. Come on. Got him! Useless, useless money. Go again. You gotta keep an eye on that freak. He's coming this way. If he interrupts me, I'm in, I'm in trouble. Don't. Don't. I'm fishing. Don't disturb a man when he's fishing. Don't disturb a man when he's trying to fish. Whatever you do. Don't. God fucking damn it. Alright. Then die! Then die! Freak! Oh! Oh, you had to call your big brother to help you, huh? Fine. Fine! I'll just have to kill you too then! Dodge roll! Jump dodge! Boom! Bam! Bah! Boom! Boom! Yeah, we got this guy. Get the hell out of here and give me these seeds. Back to it. Back to it. Eventually something will bite. There's got to be fish in these waters. I think your crops are done? Guys, I'm not incentivized to use any of those trees because last time I cut the trees down, an army of warriors rose up to try to channel me out with magic. So, uh, frankly, I don't want to use it. They started chanting like frickin' Like those guys from Abe's Odyssey, dude. They started actually chanting. Blobfish, that's one of them. We get two of those, we can cook them into a meal. We got Mudokin's frickin' like chanting away. We got another one. Boom, another one. We got another blobfish, ladies and gentlemen. We got ourselves a meal for tonight. And the sun rises on a beautiful day. And just like that, it's day. Day 10, by the way. We've been out here a week and a half on this island. On this crazy wrong island. I just listened. Dude, I was playing it like a normal fishing game, and the second I heard the sound, I clicked the button. I forgot this one's different. Come on. Come on. Come on! I can literally see a fish. Come on! Psst, 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 psst. Come on! Gotcha. I need one more. I need one more blobfish and then I can make two meals and then I'll be really good. I'll be like good to go. One more little fish. We'll chop down all the trees, I'll replant them afterward. I mean, they're not fully sized, actually. That's the thing. Those trees are not large. Got it. What the fuck is that? Become a master of the way of exploding fish. Does 200 damage. Okay. That'll kill something that comes after me. I got a bomb. I can't eat that, but I can throw it like a bomb. Guys, maybe fishing's the answer. Come on. Psst, psst, come on. There it is. Shoe. Actually useless. Can I please have one more blobfish? Just one? Dude, it's already noon. I'm back to 20% hunger. Thank you. Jesus. We need a house next. Next goal, home. What do, what do I do with those? Is it raining? Just make some fresh, frickin' fresh. And uh, let's get, let's get, let's get out of this horrible mess. Wait, why aren't I wearing my boots? 
the hell? Guys, we are at almost max hunger off of that baby. Oh, harvest crop. What does this make me? Oh my god. Oh my god. We're freaking back now, chat. I got broccoli. I'm gonna put that in there. And I'm gonna plant the rest of this once I have another shovel. Which obviously is gonna take me a hundred thousand years to get because I never have any wood. And the wood I do have, I'm afraid to cut because of the obvious- What the fuck is this? Potatoid. It's looking at me. I don't like that. I'm gonna go chance cutting down these trees even though I'm scared of what might happen. And also there's more- there's more stuff to harvest over here. Some of these have turned into large trees, so maybe I give them a little bit more time. Carrot. Carrot. And another broccoli. Cut down the large trees and maybe that we won't get any scary guys that jump out to kill me. Boom. That one's still small. All these other ones are small. Those aren't big trees. Well, they're normal trees, and that's fine. This one's big. This one's normal now. Oh! Dude, I'm so sick of it. I'm just so sick of these guys. When will you freaking learn already? It's like scary. Okay, all these other ones are small. How much wood do they get? 15's not bad. Maybe instead of immediately going back into plant things, maybe we try to see uh, what we can do about um, a house. Or I don't know, walls. Security. The sounds of these slime. I just don't want to get jumped, you know? Like, right now, we've been lucky that none of them have approached me to kill me. I have a weird feeling that's not gonna last much longer. I could make armor. Out of ten wood- OW! Oh! Oh! This place ain't good for me, chat! Back to fishing. Yep. When the going gets tough, I get back to fishing. Another useless coin. The shelterless stumbler. Guys, it's ex this game's got some expensive freaking resource construction stuff. Like, my god. Like, I gotta, I, like, we got some, like, don't starve levels of resource requirements in this game to make anything. I'm making do. I got a lot of boots, though. You ever need boots, you let me know. Alright. Lay it on me. How, how, what can I make with this? Smelter, it doesn't matter. Anvil does matter, but I don't think I can do that. Alchemy table, yeah, right. No. Electronics workbench upgrade. How do I make it? Crops and flowers grow faster and might produce more stuff when trapped in glass prisons. Uh, how do I make a house? Ten wood and ten stone. We need ten wood and ten stone. Ladies and gentlemen, we have everything we need. To make a modular house. This is not as large as I was. Where are the walls? Oh. Oh. Well. Put a roof on. 
It's not as good as it could be. But what it is, chat, is sh technically legally shelter. I bought one tile. I'm going to need some more of those. But it's something. We're going to survive. I just need a lot more stone. I gotta make another pickaxe and then I can get more stone. Wait, I already have one. Cancel that. Give me that back. Give me that back. Give it back. Oh, I'm in construction mode. That's why. Cool hat. Thank you. We're going to cut down the rest of this crap. We are going to make ourselves a house and then we will continue to stabilize after we are confident that we're not going to get jumped at night anymore. I don't care if these are small anymore. Just cut them down and need the wood. And I need it now. I need the wood and I need it now. Sorry, you're never going to grow up. Die. My man is perpetually hungry. Me, IRL. Sun's already setting again. We are cursed. We're fucked. I don't know what to do to get out of this crazy place, Chad. It's bad. It's bad. Sometimes my guy just pulls out the wrong tool and then the headbutts the item I'm trying to break. Oh no! Had just about enough. Ow! Fuck! He's got a fast swing. He's really dangerous. How am I gonna heal? When do things get good for me? No. No! 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 Back to being hungry 24-7. Can make another frickin' part of my house at least. That's something. We can move things inside after this, guys. Imagine that. Imagine having a real interior. Boom. Now, let's get some walls on this bad boy, you know what I mean? Wait, 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 wait. I didn't need two of these. God damn it! It doesn't matter. Check this one out. I'm about to blow your mind. Wait, which one of the... Oh yeah, dude. Now we just need five wood to make a freaking wall and we're out of here. Where's my jumping shoes? No, where are my jumping shoes? There they are. Boom. I can jump right out. We don't even need a door. Guys, it's just too bad that I figured this out right before I starved to death. Eat these. Can Or can I make a way to feed myself? Is there something I can cook? Not without acid. Or ice. We are gonna barely survive, but we will. We will. We're gonna make it out of here. Now, what I need to do... I can't just get in here. Wait! Yes, I can! We are now living in a strange setup. But it is gonna work, everyone. And we will no longer be attacked by creatures of the night. Because we will be safely inside of our tomb. Everything's gonna be okay. I mean, it could be way worse. This actually isn't bad. And it is protected. Well protected. Guys, welcome home. Welcome to my operation. Okay. Open roof set up. 
Now we've got loads of space. Now, what I need now is to make another freaking, uh... Need to make another shovel. Am I allowed... So, was this is a leather tree? Oh! It is a leather tree. That's... Fascinating. I don't want to cut those trees yet because they're still growing. I'm not going to cut them before their time. That's it. I'm going for the palm trees on Xenomorph Island. Guys. I'm going for the palm trees on Xenomorph Island. No, I'm fucking not. I got scared. No, I'm not. Does that mean you can plant meat? I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't even know how to heal. Guys, I literally can't heal. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about a lot of things. If I get hit again, that's it. The only way I heal is by eating food. And it's only like a tiny, teeny bit. Chop down this giant palm tree. Is that portal active? One thing at a time. Grab all the wood. Grab that. I know for a fact I'm gonna need more rocks. Mushrooms. That's good. We can make mushroom stew if I break a couple more of these rocks. Good, good. Yes, we're gonna do that then. Guys, look at my cozy little house over there. It's lovely. We're gonna make it out of here. We're gonna make it out of here. Oh, I can make the, uh, I think I have enough leather to make the inventory upgrade now, but I kind of want to plant my, uh, leather again. Let me pick this up. Eat the carrots. Grab that iron ore. Wait, this was active for a second. And now it's not. Guys, we missed our chance to use the portal. It's over now. We're not gonna be going that way. Come on. Let's get back down to base before something horrible happens. When are we- we have to free this guy. Don't attack me. Don't attack me. Don't attack- we gotta free this guy. We need to free this dog. This is a dog in here. We have to free them. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. I think I need- I need uh, I need some kind of uranium. That's not a dog. That's a dog. It said so on the sign. If you guys knew how to read. But you don't. Home sweet home. Let me check if there's anything in here that would let me heal more. Ten. Ten. What the fuck is that? Those two rocks channeling something? Stop that! Stop doing that! Hey! Stop that! I'm not gonna let you fucking channel rock bullshit at me! Yeah, right. Not gonna let that happen. Huh? Oh, that one's gone. Okay, we're gonna attack this one then. Jesus Christ. Grab that. Grab this. He goes and he goes right back to channeling. It's over. Bro, I actually got a lot of stuff off of that. What the fuck? 
They gave me freaking ore! And ingots! Hang on, I gotta go and make that inventory expansion. Big mistake channeling some kind of ritual on my property line. All right, so we got everything we need, I think, to make an inventory expansion. I just gotta grab some goop. Is that this? Good. Inventory expansion. This is the worst house. It's fine. The house is fine. One block. One inventory, if you'd be so kind, good sir. Just a lovely pile of inventory for me. Okay. Just... You know, look on the bright side of things. You got a home. You got a roof over your head. A lot of people, uh... A lot of people can't even say that. You know? Iron bars. Got a bunch of trees to cut down. That'll get us a lot of wood. I'm gonna have to make a shovel after this to dig up more. Yep. Nice roof. I don't, dude, I don't want to spend five wood on a goddamn door. Am I, you know how much of my time that's going to waste? Use your head for a second. Oh, I have to go fish. Am I even going to have time? No, I can make mushroom soup. I'm gonna wanna fish after this, though. Keeping myself barely alive. But we are still alive. Look at all this wood. Did one of my pieces of wood just roll all the way into the fucking ocean over there? And disappear? That just happened? That's really good for me. That's really good. Actually can't get that. Really can't get that log. All right, well, one step at a time. We're gonna make a stone shovel. We are gonna make a watering can. We are going to conquer this world. Watering can, check. Stone shovel, check. Grab all my seeds. Grab all my acorns. What the fuck is going on? It's just the sun setting at the same time as everything else. Everything's fine. Why are there so many shoes beneath my property? I swear to God, if a slime guy hits me right now. Who? What? Am I, like, living on a fucking, like, burial ground? Seed. 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 I want to plant some leather and then some more acorns. You get a little bit of everything when you dig. It's great. How many more acorns do I have? Six more of these. What? 
They're already growing, Chad. Look at the speed of these things. Look at the pace there. Look at the breakneck pace. All right. Hang on. I want to water these even more. What if I just water them forever? Do they, like, drown? Growing a whole ass forest. I need a whole ass forest to freaking capture this land to finally control this horrible place. Tomato, it's raining. I can't trust this rain! What the fuck is that? That's a cloud. Get back inside the house. Get back inside shelter. That world is fucked up out there. You gotta do whatever it, whatever it takes to survive. It's time to make some ores. Guys, the fact that boots don't stack means these things are basically trash. I don't know what to do about them. Old boot and a workbench makes leather. We got a solution, guys. We got it. Time to make some stuff. Leather. One. My streamer is a weenie who's afraid of clouds. make call with 10 wood okay also chat I'm pretty sure the thing is that this game has a level up system and there's like a level of like you're supposed to die so that you can do everything faster next time and I've kind of just been not acknowledging that but I think when I go out there into the world I'm gonna get pretty quickly smacked down get the staff uh, no, I there's a reason I don't want it. It's because all it does is let me hit more targets at once And I'm never fighting more than one or two targets. Why would I care? But thank you for giving me advice. I didn't ask for Enjoy the 10 minute timeout for my mods Remember that I didn't ask next time Oh this guy again Oh. All right. Thank God. An apple. Thank God. A second apple. My axe broke. See, I'm going to make an anvil now that I have the extra iron. We're about to pop off. My fucking poor inventory, though. I have so much wood. Oh, yeah, we can work with this. All right, we can we can finally work with this. Put copper away. Grab the iron. Put this leather away. Grab the coal. You have to be quick because I'm also running out of hunger rapidly all the time. Anvil. Now, two iron bars. I have to make another iron bar. Nice and easy. Guys, we are now entering the Iron Age. As soon as I grab my other iron bar out of the chest. We are going to leave this hole. Why am I blacking out? What's happening? Oh, I accidentally didn't build it. Hang on. Light that fire so I can see. And now build it again!
Boom, dude. What do we got for recipes out of this thing? And you guys were telling me to make freaking staves, dude, when I could have been investing in power fists. Morons, you don't know nothing about nothing. I'm gonna make the brass knuckles so I can defend myself properly. Oh yeah. Get a load of these. Yup. Jet, I'm going on a great adventure, partially because I'm almost completely out of any resources that I can use at my house to feed myself, and I don't feel like fishing right now. It's time to go on an adventure and learn more about this land we're in. After I eat this potato. I'm gonna keep all my rocks with me and my coal. And we're heading out to explore this land. Come on. Eat potato. I ate the potatoid. We can make a campfire on the road. Come on. We'll grab mushrooms and we'll make ourselves a delicious meal. And we will travel far to the north. Until we find our way out of this place. Through the icy wastes. I think if I kill one of these idiots, I'd get a... Uh, uranium? I mean, they have like a radioactive sign on their freaking foreheads. Oh, fuck! Fucking kick your ass for that, you little idiot. Yeah. Yeah, shoot another beam. Shoot another beam. Give me that. Guys! We gotta go save that dog. We gotta go save that dog. Still no food though, that's actually gonna be a problem. Actually. Unless my crops grew in. A little worried about that. No guys, we're gonna free the dog and then we're gonna have a best friend that'll carry us around everywhere. They didn't do anything wrong. See? Nah, that's not a dog. That's like some kind of capybara looking thing. Even better. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, hamster. He seems unhappy about his bare feet. You need three... <laughs> you need three little shoes? Uh, I can't help you with that right now. I have to go find food or I'm gonna die. But don't worry, dude. Sometime soon, I'll be back to give you shoes. If I don't die of starvation on this trip. Guys. I'm a little worried about my hunger. What the fuck was that? What the f My house! Hamster! He's fine. Oh, shit! The sky! It falls! Ain't no way one of those hits me. Guys, I have to focus. I'm gonna starve to death soon. Food. Food. Food that I can clearly eat. Ignore these. They don't matter. I have one mushroom to keep myself off of starvation, but it might hurt me when I eat it. So I'm trying to be careful. There's a box there, it might have food in it, but it's near that weird snake. That snake almost got hit by a rock, he didn't even flinch. It's attacking me. But there's meat on the ground. Sorry, freak, I'm gonna have to kill you. Sorry, idiot. 
don't you fucking even try stepping up on me. Get the fuck out of here. Boom! Give me this. Dude, pick up the stuff. Pick up the stuff. Pick up the stuff. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Alright, he's got a bit of a lunge on him. Oh! Can't you see I need to make a meal for myself? This is a beautiful place for me to make a campfire to cook a meal. That's really good. We're gonna make it out of here. As long as none of these asteroids hit me at my campsite, we'll be okay. 57%, we're back in business. We're okay. We're gonna spend some time exploring, I think. Guys, don't worry about it. None of these are gonna hit me. Oh, I can also eat these worms if stuff gets really bad. All right, another mushroom, we can eat that. It seems like some of the creatures of the world are very afraid of the asteroids. Can I do anything with these? No, it seems like they're just melting. I mean, well, like, are you kidding me? There's a, there was a real campfire right here I could have just used. That's, oh! Guys, I feel like it's only luck keeping me alive right now out here. Give me all this. No, 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 no. I gotta make this mushroom soup now. Oh! You fucking little shit! Where are you? Come out of the ground! Alright, I'm gonna make a mushroom soup. Drink it. 100%, baby. 100%. We are... Going to get the hell out of here, but I really want this food. Dude, I'm gonna have to kill this guy. So I'm gonna miss when these freaking brass knuckles I have break. But damn, they're doing a really good job right now. Uh, what I really don't need right now is, uh, I need the boot. God damn it. What I don't need is, I don't fucking give two shits about gold ore. I'm, I should, but realistically, that's not going to happen. I also don't need an acorn. Give me these. All right, I'm out of here. We are going to keep exploring for now. There's another one of those heads. Wait, what the fuck is that? Wait, what the fuck is that? What is that? I see writing over there. What? What the hell is that? No, no. What is that? Oh, there's pigs. Hang on. Sorry, freak. I have to eat you. I can also turn this... Guys, this... That's going. The, uh, bomb fish is done. I mean, yeah, I should probably just throw it at someone. But it's in the way. Guys! We made it all the way to LA, dude! I mean, the jumping shoes are pretty cool. If I could actually clear this jump, specifically. Come on. The fuck is it up there? What's up there? Old. Old Owl Dong G W R R. 
Uh, Owl Dong. Okay. Uh, Owl Dong. W R R. Swap letter. Okay. Uh, let's, I guess, type wrong world. Wait, is there even an R? There are. At the end. Maybe this will get me some kind of crazy loot, guys. If I don't get attacked by a freaking rock doing it. Oh my god, that rock is actually going to try to kill me while I'm doing this. Where's the G? Wrong. World. World. What? Guys! Oh my freaking god. Are those reading glasses? You tell me I can't wear both things? It boosts my defense by five. But. But. Eat this, we're going home. An incredible bounty today. But we're going home. Guys, we need to make shoes for our hamster. <laughs> I know some of you may be thinking that we're gonna focus on warfare? Wrong. We're gonna focus on making shoes for our hamster. Um, can I take this? Do I already have some mushrooms? I do. Pick that up. That guy's not close enough yet. Good. Drop this for a second. I said drop this for a second. Right there. Eat that. And let's go. I think this is the way I live. Animal husbandry is far more important than warfare. Exactly, guys. This hamster could end up being our best friend if we domesticate them properly. And our greatest warrior. Again, if we domesticate them properly. Why did, why did they put that hamster in a cage? Think about it. Because they're prone to violence and evil. That's all the that's all the reason I need. To get them on my side. Now I could very easily go ahead and make more shoes for them. No problem at all. Portal's open, let's go! Oh! Where the fuck am I? I made a big mistake coming here, guys. What the fuck is that? What is this? Hang on. Nuclear vacuum. You all made a big mistake picking on me because now I'm pissed off. Yep. Cool. I'm leaving the way I came. Again. Right now. Oh! What the fuck? Get back in the portal. The portal's closed! Landmines! It's all landmines! Dude, I don't know how to get back home! I don't know how to get back home! Jesus Christ! At least it's daytime and I can see now. Yeah, I mean, it's just a vacuum. Is this my home now? I mean, I'm gonna grab these mushrooms. That's oh! 
Gimme. Wait! Ain't no way. Yo! Oh my fucking god. What do you think is in this? Guess we can't even check. Was it acid? <laughs> can't tell if there's a better shovel. <laughs> the vacuum, the vacuum, the vacuum, the vacuum. Guys, I'm killing time until the portal reopens to save me. Stone shovel. I mean, the acid's really good, and I need it for things. Get rid of these fucking worms. I can get more meat. Matter of fact, I can make more worms. Fucking Christ! Does that happen to me now, or did they blow it up? Oh, we're good. Dude, this is... Dude, this place is like heaven on earth. Hang on, this is awesome. <laughs> Woo! As long as I don't get by any landmines. Huge, huge, huge. Uh, at this point, I'm gonna ditch the boot to grab gold. Woo! I'm cool. I'm cool. Boom! Inventory. Dude, the glasses need to fuck off. I don't know about them. Wait, they highlight things. Well, what do I fucking care about that? Oh, they highlight everything. Okay, I kind of care about that now. Dude. Fuck off. I'm a vacuum main now. <laughs> need to eat this. Hang on, drop this and eat these. Yeah. Worms. Ah! Oh yeah, I'm not wearing my jumping shoes. Arise, portal. Portal, arise. Arise, open, let me out of this place. Arise. Arise. Awaken, portal. Awaken. Awaken. Awaken, portal. Let me leave. Let me leave, bro. Let me leave. Dude, I want to go back to my hamster. I don't know how to get back home. Guys, I don't know how to get back home. Oh, another boot. I guess I should just do it. I can make I can make everything if I just grab these boots. Wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot boots are only a single stack. Yeah, that makes them kind of useless. I'm gonna... I think I'm just gonna ditch the boot and go grab my, uh... Brass knuckles again. Because I i don't really want to use this as a weapon. For some reason, I thought boots could stack. Please fucking open. Please fucking open. Like, yeah, I could make, like, a workbench and stuff here, but, like, I don't- I don't want to do that. I don't want to make anything because all the wood is really expensive. And the second I look away, that portal's gonna open. Watch, if I stake it out right now, it's gonna pop open. Maybe it only opens when the moon is directly- nope, we missed it. If that's the case, we missed it. I'm ready to go. Okay. Those guys don't know that's an active landmine field. Guys. If I go, I may never find my house again. What's that over there? That's it. I'm distracted. I'm leaving. We will find our home. 
It may take us a thousand years, but we will find our way back home. We have jumping shoes. It's a fucking vending machine. Meat. Omatic. Think it takes coins? Oh my god. Fuck off. Fuck off. Little idiot. Fucking actually combo to hell. Goodbye. Vacuum it up. Let's get the hell out of here. It uses coins. Holy shit. I mean, like, I'm gonna be able to survive off of all these freaking things on the ground for now. I swear to God, I'm gonna look away, though, and the portal's gonna, like, open back up. What the fuck's that out there? Guys, there's, like, wreckage in the water. I'm willing to take one more trip over to this portal to see if maybe it opened while I wasn't looking. Or maybe I can't get back up now. That's bad. Don't attack me! Oh! Go, go, go! Oh! Uh, guys? Be open, please. We are walking home, ladies and gentlemen. Our destiny oh! is somewhere out there. If we follow the coastline, eventually we will see a place that resembles our original home. Maybe we'll see something silly on the way back, too. You know what I mean? Maybe on the way back, we'll find something silly. I'm not squalored. As soon as I get back, we're gonna get my hamster. I'm gonna, like, domesticate them, and we're gonna be best friends. I know I'm in the middle of the map right now. And I know... Wait! The cage! Oh. My. Fucking. God. Chat. There it is. Home. The portal takes us quite a ways, but it doesn't take us far enough. We made it back, dude. All I have to do is travel 100,000 miles. Hang on, I want more meat. Oh yeah. Suck that up with the vacuum, let's move on. Dude, I'm gonna miss this vacuum when it breaks. This thing's really good. Baby, no! Quiet. They got what they deserved. Now, come on, guys. We're gonna go make a freaking pair of boots for our hamster. Oh my god. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Guys, the boots might have to wait. It looks like someone's channeling another dark magic in the distance. I've had just about enough of these. It's those rock fuckers. 
I've been gone for a while. They probably thought they could get away with it. I'll be right with you, hamster friend. Who the hell are you two summoning? Get ready. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not letting that play out. Dodged. 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 Ow! Brrr! Boy's gonna piss me the fuck off during this. Now you're fucked. All right. Back to work. Tomato hates the native people here and their traditions. My guy, they're channeling a dark creature from the abyss. Literally, it was rising out of the ground to kill me. I could tell. Now, if you don't mind, I have to focus on feeding myself. And a lot of other stuff. Now what's first on my docket? Drop off all my ore. Yep. And my rocks and my wood. Now I'm gonna make myself a delicious mushroom stew. Yep. I'm gonna make myself another. Later. Now, here's what I'm going to do now is I'm going to drop off my glasses. I don't need them. And this. Don't need it. Yep. Now, what I'm going to do now... Alright. Is immediately proceed to make the boots I need. Yep. Time to make some old boots. Wait, unbootifying old boot? No, I'm making two leather, leather into boot. I'm rebootifying leather into boot. Right now. One boot. I need three of them. Boom. And boom. We bring these all over to the hamster. And then we're good to go. Come on. Actually, I don't really even need the acid, do I? Not right now. Come on. Guys, we've been building up a lot towards this today. Matter of fact, this has been the only concrete goal I've had. It's time. It's time. Hamster! Hey! There you go! Fucking God. Do they have an attack? Oh, they knocked me off. Hamster, hamster, what are you doing? Hamster, get up! No! Come on, Jet. We had some exploring to do. They can climb, dude. Oh. Some uh, weird stuff going on here. Well, uh, we have some weird mountains over here as well. Good to know. So, hamster can climb basically vertical inclines uh, all on their own. No problem. No problem at all. 
I need to find another cave. I think. I'm kind of running around looking for one of those. Hi, Yeti. I don't think that thing's good. I think it's bad. Okay, so hamster can break certain things. Dude, I'm just running around grabbing loot. Keeping my eyes peeled for anything strange that might catch my eye. Didn't you make the last one by digging twice? I feel like that was just random chance. It wasn't like deliberately how it was supposed to play out for me. Is the thing. Wait, what's that? Wait, what's that? Hang on guys, there's some kind of pylon. Over here, I'm gonna check it out. There's, hang on guys, there's some kind of antenna, satellite based system over here. I'm gonna check it out too. Wait here, my steed. The hell is this? Well, I pressed the button and nothing happened. Let's go to the pylon. We need to get the fuck out of here. Don't stop running. Don't stop running. What the hell? Looked right at me. What was that thing's deal? I want to go back home. I've seen enough of the world. I'm gonna go with the digging a bunch of holes until I make a cave strategy. I like that one more. Yeah. <laughs> Don't like the snakes. Don't like why the snakes make that sound. Why do they make that sound? <laughs> Is my house over here? I think it's over here. Yeah. I think my house is over yonder. Over y over yonder this way. Over this hill. Yep, there it is. At least I know where I live. So what do you guys think this weird head wants anyways? Tell me what you desire. Head. I can't give him blood. I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to do that. Well, I can tell you one thing. We are sitting on a lot of loot and a lot of gear. I'm feeling pretty good about our supplies. Gonna make us some more copper. If I had wood, which I now do. More inventory. Hey guys, we're never getting more inventory. <laughs> guys, it's too expensive. I can't afford that. You're lucky I can afford copper bars. It's not happening. What I can do is make something to actually protect us for once from the hells of this place. I'm making us a copper helmet. Which tragically takes off my jumping boots. Damn. Copper bar, gold bar, and workbench to make an electronics table. Well, how do I make a gold bar? Is it as simple as everything else? Five gold, one coal, one smelter. I mean, I actually can. Not bad. I'm getting hungry. And what is it? Oh, I can actually just make it. I mean, I just feel like I just got to like the end game crafting item like it was nothing. Boom. 
New crafting recipes unlocked. That easily? Really? Okay, I was wrong. Uh, because that's a nuclear reactor right there. Uh, five uranium, one superconductive macro processor, and electronics workbench. Man, I barely even made copper wiring, like, I don't even know how to make a copper helmet. Okay, copper bar, and electronics workbench. Okay. Okay. Launch pad. One gold bar, one speed potion, one workbench. Dude, I'm barely able to make food to feed myself. I'm really curious if I die what the level up system in this game is. Cause like, the game did not seem to want me to do this much in one run. Oh, my tummy! Ah! Find out and die then. Guys, if I die, it's over. You're not gonna see me until next year. You're not gonna see me ever again, maybe. What the? Oh. Hamster. I mean, I, I can at least say one thing, like... Yeah, hamster? That's like a really cool... I, I dropped uranium. Seems like every- it seems like it's pretty easy to get uranium, too. It's, uh, I could probably make a- You know, I don't want to say anything crazy here, but I could probably make a nuclear reactor in a couple of minutes if you gave me a minute or two. Hang on, let me check the recipe on that again. Yeah, what's it to make? Five uranium, one superconductive macro processor, that's it, child's play. Hang on. One gold bar, one speed potion. I'd have to make an alchemy workbench to make a speed potion, but that's also probably- What the hell? What the fuck? Pneumatic drill? I, uh, didn't realize I could just make a pneumatic drill. What the fuck is that, son? Oh! Oh, this is my time! Hamster, come on! Come back! No! Oh, you're fucking far away. You run faster. <laughs> they were here for us, man! They didn't recognize me because I lived in a fucking shithole! Fuck! Dude. Just harvest the fucking crops. This is Hamster's fault. I fucking hate them. right I said it and I mean everything I said guys 70 food on this I'm making freaking carrot cake oh my god an entire delicious carrot cake it would finally heal me I could heal off of something like that. I could make some delicious french fries too. Get me out of here. Good. Ham, you know, this is, Hamster brings down the entire vibe of the base, you know what I mean? First of all, he's wearing those stupid fucking shoes. 
And look at his fucking face. He doesn't even care about being here. Fuck him. Hang on. So, let's say I want to make myself, uh, some kind of, uh, Jesus. Metal plating requires toughness potions? Okay, it seems like if we want to make anything specifically with the new stuff, we also would need a alchemy table, which is 20 wood, 5 glass, 2 glass, and 5 leather. None of that's anything that's too difficult. Like, it's fine. I don't know why I struggle to navigate the uh, menu in this game. Are you playing as an Ewok? Is your brain that fucking rotted from Disney, dude? Holy shit. You need help. You guys think I can just dig here and make a cave? If I dig enough, will I get a cave? Come on. Come on. Snake! You little piece of shit. Ah! Fuck! Where's my shovel? Ah! Oh! Oh! Go take a lot more nuts. Oh! Take me down! Little idiot! Whoa! Oh! I'll get to you in a second! Oh! I got to level two, and all I unlocked for it was boxing gloves and sneakers. I didn't unlock like anything to make things go faster. I unlocked sneakers. Level two. Anyways, guys, that's uh, <laughs> I do really like the picture though. Fun game, fun silly little weird little survival game. Uh, but, uh, that's, that's it for me. That's it for me, guys. That's it for me. All the streams this week have been a little bit shorter, deliberately. Uh, in the interest of not burning myself out, uh, I've been taking a little easy for the holidays. Chad, I will be back on Monday, okay? So keep your eyes peeled for then. Thanks for coming on by. Hope you have a good, uh, weekend. I'll catch you next time. Okay? Bye-bye, dude.